Paul says, I'm going to Jerusalem. It's not going to be comfy. The Spirit has told me that it's going to be ugly there. Comfort and Christ may both start with the same letter, but they don't end in the same place. Amen? We are not called to a comfy walk. We are called to say, God, if you're taking me to Jerusalem, I'm ready to go. I don't have to be excited about it. I don't have to say, woohoo, praise God. But I do have to say, Lord, if this is where you want me to go, what's your Jerusalem? Is your Jerusalem a marriage that you're struggling with? Is your Jerusalem a difficult situation in your church? Is your Jerusalem a kid? A teenager who's frustrating you, who you would love to send to be with the Lord even now? <laughs> I have a 16-year-old. Oh, come, Lord Jesus. The other day we had one of those moments when he was just so frustrated and he said, oh, I can't wait until I don't live here anymore. And the weird thing was, I was thinking the same thing. I don't know if your Jerusalem is dealing with an aging parent, if your Jerusalem is frustrating, a frustrated relationship you've got with somebody at your church or a boss, or if your Jerusalem is an addiction. Paul says, I don't want to go, but I'd rather go with God than go anywhere else. Amen. You see... When we go to Jerusalem, when we do what God calls us to do, I am bound in the Spirit. I am trusting you, God. I'm going to go there anyway. When we do that, we are walking in the footsteps of Jesus. Now, I know some of us heard things about churches this week, and we thought, oh, I'd like to go there. Yeah. Ah, man, I'd like to go to that church they talked about that has 20,000. I'd like to go to that church they talked about. That. The music on the stage, dude, has been so wonderful. I mean, can we all, all of us who are ministers, we have been dealing with some theological musical lust this week. I mean, you know what I mean? Dude, I wish Harvey could sing like that, I tell you what. Man, I wish we had a band like that. Lord, just send me that saxophone player. I'll take him, just him, Lord. And maybe you're going back to the place where the music is not the best in the world, all right? Maybe you're going back to the place where the preacher is not the finest in the land. Maybe you're going back to a place where, oh, goodness gracious, if we could just get through one service without the, is this mic? Is this mic on? Everybody know what I'm talking about. 